so I think the the big issue I have seen, uh, especially at the earlier stages of uh, ed tech, is uh, what we call selling the shovel instead of selling the hole. So when uh, a team is in the weeds developing a great product uh, with their engineering team, they're going to be very excited about the features uh, and all the bells and whistles of the product. That's what they talk about internally and that's what they want to share. Um, the problem is that oftentimes they are not integrating the real pain points that their target audience is looking to overcome. So there's kind of a disconnect between the people developing this tool and the end users um, between uh, features and uh, the actual benefits that they are going to get from the product. So you want to be selling the whole. Um, you don't want to be selling uh, the shovel. First, you need to develop kind of a critical mass of value content on your website. So content that's helping people um, for free uh, by entertaining them, by engaging them, and by helping them solve the pain points that your product is a is an ideal solution for. So once you have all that content on your site, once you have a critical mass built up, you can start promoting to people who don't know you. And that's really the only way that you can get people interested in your product um, at the early stages. Then you can start promoting all of your content assets through paid social, through paid search, um, through organic social and kind of uh, fanning the flame on that end. After they've become aware of you, after they have began to trust you, after they're seeing your content that provides them value, and uh, you can story sell them on your product as a solution, then you can start hitting them with sales messages.